What does idempotent mean? It means we can run the same statement over and over and over again, but still have the same outcome. Sounds functional, sounds good. So let's run this SQL to create a new table. And now we want to insert a new user. And so this is fine because we don't have a user with the username John or the email John at superbase.io. But what happens if we try and run it again? We get an error because we violated a constraint. And so is this statement idempotent? No, because every single time we run it, we're creating a new user. And so let's say we wanted our users to be able to update their email, but if they want to change their username, they need to contact us. Well, we can do that in Postgres using onConflict. And so if we run this to change my email to at superbase.com, we'll see everything's all good. Whereas if we try to insert a new user like Tyler, but using an existing email address, Postgres says no. However, if we run this with a new email address, it's all good. So is upsert idempotent? Well, yes it is. Cause we can run the same statement over and over and over again. And it only ever creates one new user and then just keeps updating them with that latest value. Be idempotent.